Greetings to the Moto Vlogging community, subscribers, and fellow YouTubers. Tractacular here. Just out for a ride this morning and stopped at a regional park for a little water bottle break. Right here along the Fraser River in British Columbia, Canada. So I was challenged by NC Stoney to do a moto vlog entitled Never Have I Ever. So there's about nine questions so like NC Stoney did uh, he took up the challenge when he was not on the motorcycle as it's kind of awkward to put the questions on the gas tank or remember them all. So I'll follow your lead Stoney and use my uh, cheat sheet here, if you will, and read out the questions and answer them. The number one, never have I ever liked a video and then unliked it. No, I haven't. Uh, the ones that I've pressed like, I've always enjoyed and thought they were produced well. Uh, sometimes I, I forget to hit the like button though because you're busy scrolling down the comments and reading them and then looking what the, the next video is you, you might like to watch and then I, I forget to hit the like button so I've, I've even come back to that particular moto vlog and, and uh, hit the like button. But I, I usually for some reason I leave a comment first and then, then I scroll back up and try and remember to hit the like button and never ever have I passed gas or burped on a video and then edited it, it out well I may have burped on a doing a moto vlog but uh, I think luckily the audio has not picked it up uh, have I ever been recognized in public as a, a youtuber Yes, I have, surprisingly. Uh, one time when I was at a Harley Davidson test our metal event, uh, a fella was, ta was talking to, you, to me and I guess he recognized my voice and said, are you tractacular? So <laughs> I said, yes, I, yes, I am. Because he said he, he's been watching some of my moto vlogs and he recognized some of the scenery and, and thought that uh, I must live in, in the area that he lived in. Ever thought of uploading a video to another platform? Uh, no, I haven't. I know when you're uploading to YouTube, there's a little spot that you can hit to upload to Facebook, but I've uh, never done that. I'm not on Facebook. And uh, I think it automatically goes on to Google Plus. So, uh, have I ever captured paranormal activity on a video? No, I haven't, but I really liked your answer, uh, uh, Stoney, where he said, uh, I never believed in flying saucers until I got married. <laughs> My wife and I had a chuckle about that. And have I ever removed a video after uploading it? Uh, no, I haven't. Have I ever scripted or read off a cue uh, cards? No, I haven't read off cue cards, and I haven't really written down any any um, paragraphs before doing the moto vlog. I try and think um, what what I'm uh, going to say before I do the the moto vlog, and sometime we'll even do a dry run before uh, pressing the record button. And uh, question number nine, never have I ever made a prank video? No, I haven't. I haven't done any pr prank videos. Uh, I've watched some of them uh, put on by other moto vloggers and found them to be quite humorous. So I think overall that is the nine questions uh, that um, NC Stoney has challenged me to under the heading 
Never have I ever. So there you have it. Um, I'm not going to challenge uh, any other moto vloggers to do these these challenges. I know the format is you you pick two other moto vloggers to do this, but uh, I'll just let uh, any other moto vloggers, if they're willing to 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 do this, feel free. No pressure. I believe uh, NC Stoney was challenged to do this moto vlog by. Um, Moto Rider, I believe, was his name. So, thank you very much for watching this Moto Vlog. So, this has been Tractacular. Until next time, take care and ride safe. Bye bye.